Clarithromycin is a, a, a wide spectrum antibiotic of the group of the macrolides. There is a growing evidence supporting the use of this antibiotic as a repurposing drug in cancer patients. A repurposing drug is a molecule that can be used for a different indication for those who was uh, uh, commercialized. Uh, this group of drugs usually uh, show a well-documented uh, uh, pharmacokinetic safety profile, pharmacodynamics, and uh, conversely to new uh, anti-cancer drugs uh, are uh, a more uh, cheaper costs. In the, uh, in the last years, some investigators used clarithromycin in uh, in vitro studies and uh, in vivo studies uh, to investigate the role of this molecule in the treatment of uh, uh, cancer. In, in particular, these antibiotics show different uh, antiproliferative mechanisms. And uh, in some clinical trials, uh, uh, this antibiotic was associated with encouraging results, most in patients with multiple myeloma or valdestrom macroglobinia. There are some anecdotal cases showing encouraging results also in patients with uh, relapsed Hodgkin lymphoma, follicular lymphoma and mouth lymphoma. In the setting of mouth lymphoma, we investigated the role of clarithromycin in a retrospective series of 55 patients with extranodal marginal cell lymphoma treated at uh, uh, the San Rafael Scientific Institute in Milan at, uh, and uh, at the University of Vienna in Austria. Uh, in the primary endpoint of this study was to uh, define the tolerability and efficacy of this antibiotic in a larger series and to investigate the role of the daily dose and the schedule of treatment in, in these patients. The uh, considered patients were treated with three different uh, uh, schedules. 32 patients receive uh, a daily dose of one gram and 23 patients receive a daily dose of two grams. The treatment was uh, uh, associated with an excellent durability. There were no cases of grade 4 toxicity and there were only three cases of grade 3 toxicity, nausea. Nausea was the main uh, side effect, uh, was more common in patients treated with 2 grams a day and uh, uh, was the main cause of treatment interruption. But uh, importantly, there were not uh, 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 cases of uh, hematological toxicity, infections, or electrocardiographic abnormalities. The overall response rate to clarithromycin was 47%, with a uh, uh, complete remission rate of 29%. And uh, uh, in uh, an exploratory analysis, the uh, subgroup of patients with gastric mild lymphomas uh, showed a higher overall response rate. At a median follow-up of 33 months, 29 patients remain uh, progression-free, with a three-year progression-free survival of 52%. Uh, no patient did of lymphoma, and uh, the, uh, the comparison of these results with uh, uh, those uh, obtained in some phase two trials uh, with uh, uh, other uh, uh, modern molecules uh, like uh, ibrutinib, lenalidomide, uh, bortezomib, everolimus, show that clarithromycin is associated with a similar activity and efficacy, but with a significantly better uh, tolerability and with a, a high cost uh, effectiveness. In the future, uh, we are conducting a trial uh, that started, uh, uh, the accrual started recently, uh, uh, using a combination of clarithromycin plus lenalidomide in patients with relapsed refractory mouth lymphomas. Uh, the combination is based on the excellent results in terms of safety and tolerability as single drug in, in mouth lymphomas, but also as combination in patients with multiple myeloma. Moreover, clarithromycin is able to overcome the resistance to lenalidomide in patients with multiple myeloma. The trial is, is called uh, CLEO trial, 
and it's a full oral combination for a patient with relapsed and refractory mouth lymphomas. The hypothesis is that the addition of clarithromycin will improve the overall response rate from 60% to 75%. And this may be a new strategy, chemo-free, uh, less expensive for this subgroup of patients.